Hey everyone, thank you for joining me today. I'm Miss Nene, and welcome to Miss Nene's Art. So as you can see, I have the, the infamous orange package in front of me. I am doing my second Timu haul. Um, I don't even remember what I ordered. I know I ordered some crafting things. I ordered some molds and a few other things that I thought was pretty cool. So let's go ahead and get into this. Um, this is a big one. I feel like there's a lot of big boxes in here. So I'm not even really sure what's in here now. because I ordered a few different things and um, they got split up. So let's see. The packaging is a little beat up. So let's hope that nothing inside is beat up. <clears throat> okay. So let me move this aside a little bit. I'll just rip into that. This is so exciting. It's like it's like Christmas. Alright. Right off the bat I can see some anime dolls because I went to an anime convention. Let me turn this light off. There we go. And it was really cool. My daughter, my youngest daughter, who is an adult, um, she's not a little one, but um, she loves anime. And I respect that, obviously, because I got some anime figurines I thought was really cool. Let's see. Okay. Box is a little beat up, but that's okay. Oh, she comes with like a little fan. A chair. A little set up her sword. You gotta put her together. But she's cute. So that's nice. Probably just give that to my daughter. See, <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember this the skull water bottle. This look at that, that is so cool. Look at that, another anime doll. She feels heavy. She has a stand. She's got wings. Oh, get to put her together. <laughs> Here's her head. Let me And then her her wings and then her stand. And another <laughs> another anime figurine. I guess I can show you. She also has wings. Similar. 
Oh, wait a minute. So I accidentally got two. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Guess I'll keep one and give one to my daughter. That's crazy. I didn't realize I did that. Okay. Um. What do we have here? my other daughter she likes tiny little cute things so I think this qualifies as tiny and cute so that's going to her this um I think it's a wall tapestry let's see tapestry Oh, these little things you can use to hook them up, to hang it up, I mean. So these are the little hooks. I will open this up and lay it down so you can see the full, because I don't have any room on this table right now. But I will open this up so you can see what it looks like before the end of this video. All right, so I found my molds. These are wands yeah so like one two three four five six make six different wands this is gonna be cool if you can see the detail inside so this is one mold and <laughs> Here's another one. I was really excited about this one. I don't know if you can tell, but it's a dragon. There's his head and his body. And it's also another thick, decent mold, nice and solid. This, I can't wait to do this one. Use some some chameleon powders on here. Oh my God, it's gonna be so cute. So I have that, that's really nice. What do we have here? Another set of molds. I remember these, these are shaped like light bulbs. And it has a stand, so here's the stand. And here, molds, you get four. And look at how cute they are. They look like little light bulbs. This looks like it could be fun to do, so I'm gonna do that too, pretty soon. Guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see me use all these amazing molds. Here is another one. I think this one was just like a mountain thing. Yeah, they're like little, like a mountain all the way around. So, let's see. Where does the resin go in? Oh, duh, right <laughs> on the top and into these little grooves. And then that's gonna be really cool. Yeah, can't wait to use that one too. And another set of molds. Timu has a lot of really cool molds. Okay, this is another coaster set. But look, this is more Halloween. So this is the stand. And look, it's like vampire teeth or wolf teeth or whatever. 
an animal's fangs. This is the stand I'm thinking. And this, these are the coasters. There's four different ones. It looks like there's three that's got a design on them and one that doesn't. But this one has nothing. And this one has some creepy little skull with some symbols around it. If you can see that. And this one has the sugar skull. Hopefully you can see that. And then like all the little Halloween Halloween things, like a little casket, spider webs, a ghost, a bat, skulls, a, cra a raven, a cat, <laughs> skull and crossbone. So that'll be a cute um, Halloween video. And what do we have here? Okay, another mold set. This looks like a little trunk, like a treasure chest. Yeah. It has all the fixtures, the hooks, the, the lock. This is the top of it. I'm not sure what this is yet. Maybe these are the legs and the base. Maybe. I, I'm not sure. Yeah. The base. Let's see. And then you have the. I'm not sure what these are, but. I will figure it out, figure it out. And here's another cute mold. This is a snail. I thought it was bigger, but it's not. That's cute. That's going to be fun to make, too. I'm going to make that one. What else? Another set of molds, another coaster mold set. This one has a very unique base. Huh. And here are the coasters. They're like an octagon shape. You get one, two, three, and four. So that's very cool too. And I've got some round wood circles. They're for making earrings. I hadn't made jewelry in a while. I used to make jewelry all the time. But then I saw these and I'm like, okay, let me go ahead and throw together some cute handmade earrings made out of wood. You got the, the little hooks for your ears. You got the jump rings. And then you got these little pieces. That's going to be really cute. You can do some acrylic art on that. And then seal it with some resin or a sealer of your choice. Or no sealer at all. I got myself a journal. Look at that. Let's open this up. I saw this. I thought it was so cool. I will try to find these links to the things, the silicone molds and anything else, everything else that I got, um, if they're still available, because things do sell out really quick on Timu. Look at this book. Just look at the detail. Got the rustic pages, and it has the little bookmark inside. And look at that on the back. <laughs> that is so cool. That's really nice. I got a few. Earrings. Or maybe just one. Look at this one. There. Vodka. <laughs> Look at that. Little vodka bottles. 
for earrings. How cute. I may give that to my daughter. <laughs> she collects a lot of cute little earrings for me. From like Sheen and this ring I got on, I got from another um, shipment from Timo. I think it's really cute. And I've got another ring here that I just got. It's a dragon. Look at that. How cool is that? Put it on this finger. This way. That's really cool. Okay. Let's see. Got a couple of, oh, found something else. Ramen noodle earrings. <laughs> oh my God, how cute. If you love ramen noodles, here you go. <laughs> These are so cute. Okay. I've got this box. Let's see what's in it, because I don't remember. Okay. It's a little fairy standing at the door. This is going to go in my fairy garden outside. Look at how cute that is. detail. That is so adorable. I love that. That's going right out in my fairy garden. I think I'm going to do a video so you can see what it looks like now and what it's going to look like once it's done. Because I've got some things out there already. I just need to add more stuff to it. But we'll see. Here is another box. This one is pretty big. What in the world is this, Renee? All right, let's see. Let's get this last box right here. I think. I think that might be it. Yep. Okay, what do we have here? Wow. It's it's a lamp. <laughs> it's a lamp. It's a raven lamp. This is where the bulb goes into the controls and the raven <laughs> oh my god um i have to figure out how this goes that is really nice huh didn't come with any. See, it just kind of sits. Didn't come with any instructions, so. I'm gonna have to figure it out by myself. But it, I'm kind of remember what the picture looked like. I think it holds the cord in his mouth and it dangles down. But in any case, I'm gonna plug this in put it together and let you see by the end of the video, as well as the, um, the, um, the cloth, the wall hanging tapestry. And this, I think I know what this is. This may be my dragon incense. 
Look at that. What is this? Oh, look, he came with this little ball. And it sits in here. And then you put the incense on top. And then the backdraft from the incense has the incense, the smoke going down and around the ball. I'm going to... What a mess. I'm going to put an incense on here. And I'm going to show this to you, too. I'm going to show you everything. So I'm going to show you that. Okay, well, you know what? This was a shorter haul than my first one, but everything is so cute. So I'm going to go ahead and set this up. This up. And I'm going to set up this tapestry so you can see it, what it looks like all the way open. And um, I'll leave the link to everything, if it's still available, in the description below for you, in the description underneath the video. And um, I think I got some incense somewhere around here, some, the right ones. Now you can't just put regular cone um, incense in. I have to show you. Hold on. Okay, so here it is. Look at the crow. He's holding the light by the cord. That is so cool. I absolutely love that. I will definitely leave a link to this for you. I'm going to search and see if they still have this one available. Because I know it's sold out and I couldn't get it the first time. And then the second time, I got an alert that they were available. So I went on ahead and hurried up and ordered it. Love it. And here's the dragon. I did find the incense. Now you can't use just regular cone shaped um, what do you call it? Incense, you have to use special ones. This is called, see how it just comes this out? has a hole at the bottom. And then this has a hole on top. And that's how it works. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and set up the last thing. Okay, so here it is. Sorry if the lighting isn't that great, but look at how beautiful that is. I may just hang this over my bed. Look at the detail in that. I'll leave the link to this as well in the description for you. That's gorgeous. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video haul of Timu.com. I absolutely love getting things from them. And I think, you know, with all the silicone molds that I've gotten and the ones that you saw today, I think it's worth it. I really do. If you can wait for the shipment to come, and I think that one took almost two weeks not quite but I well about two weeks that this one took two weeks but normally they don't take that long maybe a week and a half maybe but I enjoy doing this so let me know what you think in the comments below don't forget to like and subscribe and comment thanks so much for watching next time bye bye